Hey Bowerman fans, welcome back to the exercises with Bowerman. Today we'll be doing kettlebell drills and crawling. This is a staple of Bowerman core, so uh, get ready to get the inside. This is the first exercise of the upper body. And with this you want about, a, if you're a man, you want about 15 to 20 pounds. And uh, this is called the waiter walk, where you hold this as high as you can. And you want to keep your your back straight and your core stiff. Make sure you keep your glutes engaged. And you're gonna keep it like this for about a minute and then you're gonna switch hands. Then you're gonna switch hands, do the same thing with the other side. Now guys wanna do 15 to 20 pounds, girls will probably do 10 to 15, but you can adjust it as you go. It's better to keep better form um, and have lower weight than higher weight and be struggling to keep your wrist straight. We often pair our kettlebell carries with crawls. So first, I'm gonna demonstrate the sideways crawl, left and right, and then we're gonna go left and right again with a push up every other crawl. So we're gonna first do six each way, forward, back, and then I'll demonstrate the push up. Next we'll do the same, left, right. Three push-ups going down left and three push-ups coming back right. Next we have suitcase carries and uh, you want to make sure when you do all these exercises that you don't lean back, that you just have a right weight where you can keep good form, good posture and uh, do these things properly. With the suitcase you want to have your shoulder a little bit out and the other side keeping the same form essentially so it looks like this and uh, ideally you'll do these with heavier weight. Do that for one minute, then you switch hands. Next, after the uh, suitcase carry, we're gonna do a forward backward crawl. Um, six again, each way, forward back, and then the second portion will be forward backward crawl with a split push up. After that, we have walking halos. And again, make sure when you're doing these halos that you're not leaning backwards and instead keeping your form nice and straight. You do each one of these 10 times clockwise, 10 times counterclockwise.
say that was 10. Next, we've got the sidewinder again. Six is a magic number here. Six going left and six going back right. Um, the key to this one, make sure you use a slow cadence. We want to keep control the whole way through the motion, down and back. Here's what it should look like. Other than suitcase carries, you want to have this back to 15 pounds, 15 to 20 if you're a girl, 10 to 15. This next exercise is walking heartbeats. Make sure again, you keep your shoulders square and you have a slow cadence when you're walking. Again, don't, do, don't lean backwards. Don't let that happen. Make sure you keep square shoulders. Do that for about one minute. Next, we've got a walking shoulder press. Um, you want to use the weight, what is comfortable for you. Nice, tall posture, all the way up. And back down again. Five each arm, switch arms, two total sets. Here we go. Now we have 10 big halos standing still. So before we were walking with halos, now we're gonna go wider. We're gonna, keep, we're gonna go slower. We're gonna do 10 clockways, clockwise, 10 counterclockwise. That's five, we'd usually do 10. Another five, we usually do 10. To finish these exercises, we have standing heartbeat. Woody has already demonstrated the walking happy, but this is gonna be again stationary. 15 times, nice upright tall, nice stance, shoulder width apart, out and in 15 times, nice and controlled. There's 10, just for demonstration purposes. Our last walk is called the crab walk. Uh, and during these, we go forward out uh, 10 yards and then back 10 yards. And then we go forward out 10 yards and we do opposite hand to opposite leg. I'll demonstrate. Make sure you keep your butt up the whole time.
Now opposite hand, opposite leg. That's a pretty standard routine that we have at BTC. We do that about once a week along with other core. Um, it's something easy to do at home. All you need is two weights, one dumbbell, one kettlebell, uh, one a little bit heavier than the other. Uh, but uh, you know, that's, that's all we got for you this week. I'm Woody Kincaid, that was Mark Scott. Uh, make sure you stay in shape during this quarantine and stay safe.